hi guys so welcome to my youtube channel hi guys welcome back to my youtube channel my name is Theodosia. um i have not done like i feel like i've not done a vlog in a while because it's been almost two weeks that i've recorded but i'm sure you guys will like be seeing videos regularly now i have not been posting like even now i've not posted for over two months anyways this video is supposed to be a live update vlog i guess um so by the title of this vlog you guys already know i am currently homeless i feel like i don't have a house um if you guys can see my background i have been living in elizabeth's house i've been squatting in elizabeth's house for a little over two weeks now because i don't have water in my house i've not had water in my house and nothing was being done about it and i had to live my life right i feel like if i were in nigeria i would be able to like you know maybe buy pure water or get meruas to come and bring water into my house but it's a little bit you know it was a little bit difficult for me actually being a foreigner as well trying to like you know get the f the problem fixed so i decided to move out because i needed to eat i needed to shower i needed to work i had to go around and that was not happening so i mean i just i just left the house pending when they get the issue fixed i think it's getting resolved now so fingers crossed i think i'll, I'll let you guys know maybe at the end of this vlog if i if i do end up going back you know within within a week or within the next two weeks i'll let you know how how long it took but yeah i've not had water in my house water is not flowing in there's just a lot of complications that happened and yeah i'm i'm currently in elizabeth's house um so another thing i don't know if you guys remember this was was this before my this was before my um rodrigue's vlog right this was before i went to rodrigue's so this was before my birthday i bought an iphone 13 pro solely because i wanted to use it to create content and everything and that video that that phone literally caused me a lot of issues i went to rodrigue's my videos were not they were clear but the audio quality was very terrible initially i thought it was the audio the phone settings but it ended up not being uh, i'm just going to put one raw footage so that you guys will see it Sunning, the trip was stripping, <laughs> and we are going back home. I think I'll see you guys at the airport. So it's 12 now. Um, the airport transport just arrived, and our flight is by 2:55. So we're going to spend some time in the airport before we get to Mauritius. Our flight usually from Madrid to Mauritius is one hour. So yeah, let's go. <laughs> and then, um, I mean, it's just been three months since I bought that phone, and I decided to just get a new phone. So you guys, I bought a new phone. I bought a 14 Pro. Um, that's exactly what you guys are watching me from. That's what I'm using to record. I bought it yesterday actually. I wanted to record the process. Like going to get the phone but to be honest i was still with the old phone and it was causing me a lot of like i wasn't just happy anymore using the phone because i wanted to record content i can't like you know record content and sit and talk to you guys or you know go out and i'm trying to show you guys you, you guys won't even hear me right and then i probably have to do a voiceover and it takes a long time or i probably have to you know, work on the audio i think i tweeted this some time ago that i was editing a vlog and the audio wasn't nice so yeah i decided to get a new a new a brand new phone so i don't have any issues with it there's warranty on it so if there's any issues i'm going to take it back to the apple care and then they fix it that's the update to you guys that's the update how are you guys doing i recently posted something on instagram and um, instagram stories and my youtube community asking you guys if i want to if i should do a um q and a or if i should do a youtube live video it's a mix of both because on youtube i think a lot of people wanted youtube live and on instagram people wanted q and a so i think i'm going to do both i will let you guys know in my community tab 
Um, mm-hmm. I think maybe by the end of this year, maybe by the coming year, um, I need to churn out a lot of my videos. So, um, yeah, I would. You guys should just make sure you subscribe to my channel. Make sure you check my community t- tab, and those information is going to be there because I'm going to post. You know when I eventually want to do the live video. I didn't know you guys were interested in doing the live video. Anyways, if you guys had checked my watched my previous vlog, you would have seen that I um made my hair some time ago. My hair is still is still flourishing. I'm thinking of I've been thinking of locking my hair for the whole of 2023. I might lock my hair very soon. I just wanted to see you know how it is so yeah i'm going to i'm going to keep this hair for two months so i have one month and two one month and two weeks to go before i remove this hair if you don't follow me on tiktok you are sleeping because i i would think i'm more active on tiktok this year but yeah i wrote this in my wish list and i got this gift from elizabeth um and Lincoln. i wanted something that would you know be very easy something that would even be more aesthetic for my videos and i think this kind of i've unboxed it guys i feel like this would you know make it look very nice i can literally cook anywhere countertop just make it look cute if i'm going for a staycation i can carry my i mean within mauritius i can carry my stove and everything and then you know cook there and you guys would enjoy it <laughs> so let me show you guys let me unbox this thing and show you i open it like i've not opened i didn't open it some some few minutes ago the smell of brand new the smell of brand new if you guys want to know where i got this from let me know in the comment section i'll put it there they did not they did not sponsor this video so i cannot say their name please i got this stuff from I got this stuff from the post office this morning. I just went to pick it up. Um, um, I ordered it last week. I paid and had it sent via post. So yeah, I'm going back home to test them. They are gym outfits. I was thinking of buying from Shane. You guys, when I went to Le Mans to hike, my gym shorts tore when I was coming down at the bot. And there's no way that I'm going to even mend it because it's at this point it's gone. So I got new sets because I want to go back to the gym. If you guys can see, like I've added a little, a little bit of weight because I have not been working out for like I think three months now. So I'm going to go home and test this. You guys will see when I go home. Precious is here, so let's go. I'm still living in Elizabeth's house. Literally, I was thinking about this thing yesterday. Like, if I don't have friends on this island, where would I be living? Like, at this point in the month where you've literally paid all your bills and you have you don't have so much money to spare or so much money to spend, and then things like this happen. And I'm thinking, like, okay, I don't have family members here and for some reason maybe i don't have friends in mauritius what am i going to do with myself am i going to be living under the rock under the bridge where am i going to be living literally because my water issue has not been fixed and 
my landlord and whoever is responsible have not literally been replied like i literally called them this morning anyways that one aside we are going to cascavel we're very hungry we need to eat before we start our day because our day has not started literally my day has not started if i've not eaten hi guys so i'm actually still homeless not not actually i am very very homeless my water issue is not fixed i've still not gone back to my house i'm still living in elizabeth's house they've closed this room back um so now i am on the house hunting market i've been looking for a house actively now right and then so i went to look for an apartment today i went to look at two apartments today i'm just going to show you guys while i'm talking the first one is twenty-seven thousand for rent and three thousand for light bill and if you use why you why am i paying three thousand that's like even the first red flag the apartment is really really small for me even though like it's just me i have a, a lot of stuff like even my deep freezer where's my deep freezer going to stay in that apartment so yeah um that apartment is a no-no it's really far from the bus stop i don't have a car so how do i even get to the apartment like how do i even move around if i want to buy stuff how do i get there if i want to go to the mall how do i go and buy things so that one is off completely oh so it's not in sweet So how much is this one going for again? This one is twenty seven thousand a month. Let's see how many The next one that we went to see is eighteen thousand. It's three bedrooms. It's to be honest, it's one and a half bedroom because that last room is not a room. It can be converted to a room, but it's not a room. Um it's smaller than my apartment but it's manageable my current house but it's manageable um i don't know i'm still thinking if i would take it it's 18 i think i will take it 18 is a fair price for three bedroom it's not too far from the bus stop it's it's small but i have to manage it essentially so yeah with that being said guys i don't know I can't keep waiting for like a whole month till till my house issue is fixed. I just would probably just you know move. Another thing I noticed is there's AC in only one room. There is no AC in the other room. Now you guys, the issue is the water authority in this in in Mauritius. They are just doing a whole lot that really nobody asks them because if I'm being honest, there was no water issue before and then now certain houses and apartments do not have water you guys what do you think should i take this apartment please put in the comment comment in the comment section if i should take the apartment or not um yeah i have to even go back home now and put a lot of my things for sale because i don't want to carry a lot of unnecessary luggage and things yo Down. Be free in this place. Sir. Our prayer is that you encounter the living God. Our prayer is that you meet with God in this place. You feel like you need to write down things that He's saying to you. You grab your journals, your pens, just begin to sit down and write down. Just let the, the worship team minister, and then we're going to wrap it in a song together.
Ce soir, c'est pas goodbye. And tonight is not goodbye. Mais... Hi guys! <laughs> oh my god, I just realized that I have not given you guys an update. <sighs> okay. Um, I think it's almost a week and a half since I gave you guys the last update. I was looking for a house. Anyways, last week Monday, so today is Sunday. You guys, you guys already know the background. I'm in my house, but let me tell you why I'm in my house. I come regularly to water my plants. As you guys know, let me just quickly show you. See, my plant is already dying because I've not been coming as frequent. This is supposed to be, I'm supposed to be watering this every day. But yeah, I came to water my plants. My aloe vera is thriving. The other one that is thriving. This one is dead. That other one at the other end is dead. Anyways, so I came to water my plants, get new change of clothes. I'm just chalk up on my house in general. Today is Sunday. So last week, Monday. It makes it exactly a week ago. Um, I got a call saying, oh, the tank will be fixed today, blah, blah, blah. But tell me why when the tank was delivered and the plumber came to do the whole fixing and everything, it was a wrong tank that was delivered. It wasn't the exact tank that we asked, you know, them to buy. And they used exactly one month to buy that tank. So on that Monday or maybe the next day, I don't know, the return the tank to be delivered and right now i don't know when the new tank could be um will be here or the right tank could be here to be fixed but i actually just came to water my my plants by the way this one that is dying is mint leaf i can actually still smell the mint but it's just it's dying i need to be watering it every day but yeah that one is by the way um that's you guys i still i mean i have a house but I can't actively live in my house because there is no water. Um, I also came within the week to, you know, empty my fridge because the things in my fridge have started spoiling um, the bread, fruits and everything. And I had to, you know, take it out. And yeah, so that's it, you guys. I'm just going to up update you maybe in my next vlog if everything has been resolved. I'm going to be ending this vlog here because like this vlog... It's just sadness upon sadness. I really don't know why. I really don't know why it's that hard to fix it or fix this water issue. But yeah, you guys, if you guys if you guys enjoyed this video for some weird reason, please do let me know. Let me know in the comment section. I'm using my hand to hold my phone. Apparently, that's why my hand is shaking. But yeah, um, you guys. So you see the background there there's just a lot of chaos going on in the background but just put your condolences in the comment section <laughs> put your condolences in the comment section i am tired like i am mentally drained i'm physically drained but yeah one thing to note is i'm actually happy so today we clocked or uh, we have three thousand just a little over three thousand subscribers on this channel and i'm really really happy like today was the actual day like when i got home i was just trying to you know check my phone and just chill here for a little bit before i go back but yeah 3000 subscribers i just want to say thank you to everybody who has subscribed who watches my videos who engages and comments you guys are you guys are amazing to be honest you guys are really really amazing like i i was planning on 5k subscribers but i know that i have not been active for a very long time so yeah <laughs> Thank you guys. Um, do let me know in the comment section what you guys want to see from, you know, this channel. You know, 
moving on coming up you know just let me know and that's it guys i'll be seeing you guys in my next vlog bye the lord has done it finally finally the Lord has done it all. Finally, 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 I said the Lord has done it all. Finally, 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 the Lord has done it all. Finally, 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 I said the Lord has done it all. Finally, 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 I said the Lord has done it all. Finally, 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 finally